Today I have the new uh, Jurassic World uh, Legacy Collection Velociraptor, which to me looks about uh, similar to the Lost World Raptor, maybe. Has the brighter yellowish tan uh, paint job with brown on the top. Uh, this one is actually spring loaded. Something. That was the easiest unboxing. Okay, as you see in the back here, I have the same Raptor, pretty much different paint job. This one came in a uh, I think it was five or so piece uh, collection set that you can buy. And then there's also a collection set with the Dr. Graham figure and the Raptor and all the rest of the collection. So, anyway, these Raptors, uh, let's see how. Okay. Well, did not work. Are spring loaded. I think my older one that I have here is a little better. As you see, they spring forward, and reason for the big feet that everyone complained about is to keep them balanced as they jump. Here is the scan code. This is not working well. There it is. And for the other one. Okay, now for articulation, mouth opens of course, you have right and left on the head, which the only sad part is you cannot turn the head normally left, it sort of goes on an angle. But either way, you have your down and up. You got your arms that go up or down or out. Um, for leg articulation, there is zero because they both are on a spring to make for the jumping mechanism. Here is the paint variant version. They actually did really well on the paint apps on these. I am quite impressed. Okay. Now for size comparison, we will throw them all in there. And yeah. I think uh, it is pretty cool. Uh, let's see if I can get the raptor to jump at Malden. That worked. Fell over, but it definitely works as a good little gimmick. So, all in all, I think you could have hours of fun with these, really.
I know I am, and I'm supposed to be doing a review right now. Um, let's see. With another size comparison, you have the Galliminus, which eh, comes in half decent, I would say. Galliminus actually looks a little short, but who knows? We've never really seen Raptors and Galliminus next to each other. And then we also have Big Old Rexy. Um, Raptor size looks pretty good. And once again, of course I forgot to make Rexy the same scale. So, you got your humans, you got your raptors, you got Gallimimus. Um, the only thing I've noticed so far is the pterodactyls and uh, a couple other ones are a little bit out of scale, but overall they did really well in the paint apps. Uh, the little gimmicks that they got, like the jumping, quite awesome. I have noticed uh, for people who are a little picky about the feet being different clown shoes, I guess I've heard. Uh, we, we also have smaller feet versions, which are more normal. <laughs> so if you don't like the clown feet raptors, uh, just don't get them. But I personally am happy as long as they have sickle claws. So everyone out there, have a good night. And thank you for watching.